guys welcome back to my channel today's video is going to be a demonstration and rather showing you guys what my favorite lipstick um, lipsticks are by a particular brand so tonight's feature is going to be Mary Kay I know everyone is familiar or should be rather familiar with the Mary Kay brand they have been around for a number of years uh, a personal consultant to come and share with you um, new product launches get you give you rather the opportunity to try the products buy the products make recommendations sort of like having a personal um, cosmetic consultant to just come into your home and share with you so if you're interested in seeing some of my very favorite Mary Kay brand lipsticks then please do indeed stay tuned for the video okay let's get started the lipsticks that I'm going to show you I will demonstrate for you however I'm not going to be wearing a liner so the live swatch you will see will actually be what the lipstick will look like on someone with my skin tone now all of these shades may not for rather may not be fall appropriate for some but I would wear these easily throughout all seasons so the very first one I'm gonna start in the nude family and then graduate my up to the darker tones so the very first one is called uh, copper I believe copper what is this copper star and just a note, um, you can find these or purchase these lipsticks rather on the Mary Kay website, locate a personal consultant in your market and hook it up that way. Um, they retail for $15. I find that they're very moisturizing um, lipsticks. They're very creamy in texture, fragrance free, and they have great, great rather color payoff with minimal bleeding um, and feathering on the lips. So again, the first one is Copper Star, and Copper Star looks like this. It's a nice copper tone nude. I will consider this in the nude family. And I am wearing Copper Star. Um, right now. So this is Copper Stone. Okay. And just as a point, I forgot to mention earlier, in the video just as a point of reference I since I am going to be swatching and taking off lipstick placing putting on lipstick rather I like to use the Mary Kay brand satin lips it's a lip mask it looks like this and then there it I follow it up with the satin lips lip balm so you too um, can also purchase this from your Mary Kay consultant or on the website all right let's get going the next one I'm going to be sharing is called sweet nectar and I think in my opinion sweet nectar is like a peachy peachy style nude I'll go ahead and swatch it also on the back of my hand I don't know if it's gonna show up there you go that is sweet nectar and I'm gonna go ahead and put sweet nectar on okay this is sweet nectar again this is a pink peachy rather nude um, so appropriate for a smoky dark eye um, if you want it like a neutral or nude lip again this is sweet nectar moving right along into our next shade this is going to be like a pink nude and this is called pink shimmer and pink, pink rather shimmer looks like it looks kind of deceiving you would think it would be a little bit more pinker in, in tone and color but this is pink um, pink shimmer I think I said yep pink shimmer a pink nude again this is pink shimmer really isn't in my opinion as pigmented as the first two I demonstrated but pink shimmer Next is a darker um, nude, and this is called Golden. And Golden looks like so. And I'll give you a swatch on the back of my hand. <clears throat> Excuse me. Really more 
of a like a gold tone type um, lipstick so let me demonstrate this lipstick has certainly taken a beating and again this is golden a little bit darker I like a darker nude not as a brown deep brown but certainly something I would definitely wear with a like a bold eye because we're still in a nude family again this is golden the next one up is tan and tan uh, has been through a war with me I'm embarrassed to show you what oh I didn't know it looked like this I think it got stuck in the tube actually how shameful I'll try to work with this I may have to grab a lip brush to um, put this one on you guys I didn't know it was like that but anyway um, again this is <clears throat> excuse me tan and that is tan on the back of my hand not picking up too much but the color is almost have to just and here is the shade tan still in a new family and yes I would wear it with a bold eye tan The next shade I would like to show you guys is called Garnet Frost, and Garnet Frost is more of a pink tone, and this is what Garnet Frost looks like. Let's see if I can't get a swatch the back of my hand, that is Garnet Frost. Garnet Frost. This is a little bit more pigmented than the previous one, you guys, or a few before that. But this is a nice tone pink, and some may not think or rather consider a pink lip in the fall. I know I do. Doesn't matter the season, but there you have it. Okay. The next one I have is um, Sunburst, and Sunburst, in my opinion, is definitely more of a pink coral more so on the coral side of the shade and that is sunburst now some of these shades I will mention in the down bar are no longer available but not don't fret you may contact a local um, uh, Mary Kay consultant and they may have some of this still in their inventory so here we go again this is Sunburst. It does kind of look a little orange. A little bit of orange in it. But it's certainly a nice, really pretty color. I'm going to graduate up, so to speak, into more of the browns. And the next one I'd like to show you is called Rich Cocoa. And Rich Cocoa is a deep brown. And it looks like that. And that is a swatch on the back of my hand. I don't really have a lot of brown shades, so let's see. Again, this is Rich Cocoa. Pretty, pretty shade. Now this will probably be to some more fall appropriate as, um, you know, the darker lip shades are more in tune right now. But, what do you think? Next one up is in the red family and this one is simply called just that red. It's really not a true true red in my opinion. Um, so let me give you a swatch of the red on the back of the hand. Comes across a little bit different than what it looks like in the tube. That is the color red. And let me demonstrate for you. Again, I'm not wearing any liner with these, so the, the tone or the, rather the shade could mm, considerably have some slight changes if you choose to wear a liner. But this is the color red. And my very last shade I'm going to show you guys is called 
black um, cherry and this is what black cherry looks like and I don't know in the red tone black cherry but you guys these lipsticks are so super moisturizing and feel really really good on the lips so let's put on black cherry and here you have black cherry so that's going to, excuse me, rather conclude my lipstick swatches from the Mary Kay brand. Let me know what you think. I am going to be doing a series. I can't decide which lipsticks, rather brand, I'm going to choose next. But I will definitely be doing maybe some MAC. I definitely know I'm going to do MAC. Um, maybe some Sephora brand lipsticks, Revlon, on drugstore, maybe beauty supply brands as well. So. I appreciate your support and I will be chatting with you on the next video. Bye guys!